Ah, listen, bitterly disappointed. Um, I think everyone can see how much we poured into the game. Um, we obviously get ourselves into a real good position at half time. Um, you believe that there's always going to be some sort of um, fallout from Rangers' point of view. You know there's going to be a reaction. Um, and I probably, as you said, the players there, uh, I never want to be a glorious loser. So I don't want to sit here in front of anybody and start to make excuses or uh, you know start to pat ourselves in the back because we get to this stage. It's been a good achievement to get here. Um, but we just felt that in moments of the game, we probably just lacked that wee bit of composure um, and a wee bit better decision making. I think the second uh, the second goal is symptomatic of that. Second goal Rangers get, they'll probably, uh, well, it's, it's a foul on Zach Robinson, I think, which the referees maybe acknowledged at the time, but he stays on his feet, tries to keep the ball alive. Um, and it's possibly just at a spell in the game where if we manage it better and make a slightly better decision, no criticism of Zach, he's too honest sometimes. Um, but I just felt that that was one that led to a square pass and obviously the, the, the break and the counter attack at that stage for, for Rangers um, and from our own point of view I think we just have to we have to look to uh, improve slightly on the ball that will be the bit that would get us over this hurdle um, that's not a criticism that's what we want to try and evolve to um, but the next stage for us off the back of what is a sore one today is just to try and pick the players up because we don't want a hangover off the back of a disappointing day.